Welcome to Phone Arena's video review of the Motorola Devour A555 available through Verizon Wireless. The Devour is now the third Android smartphone available through Verizon after the Motorola Droid and HTC Droid Airs. It is constructed out of extruded aluminum which gives it a sturdy and durable feel. As you can see, the Devour is roughly the same size as the Motorola Droid and both open up to reveal the internal QWERTY keyboard. We like the new keyboard layout on the Devour as the buttons are now separate and have some space between them, making it more comfortable to type with. However, the optical D-pad isn't as precise as we would like. The Devour comes with a 3.1 inch capacitive touchscreen with a resolution of 320 by 480. When used next to the Motorola Droid, you can clearly see the difference in size and resolution. One of the main features of the Devour is the Moto Blur user interface. It integrates social networking services like MySpace, Facebook, and Twitter with your Google account, email, and Exchange servers. You can place widgets on any of the five home screens to continuously keep you updated. It shows you the current news, which you can easily slide through, as well as a happenings, which shows your latest post from friends, your current messages, which integrates email and text messages, as well as a place to upload your current status. All in all, the Moto Blur interface is a nice addition to the stock Android 1.6 OS. The WebKit browser renders pages nicely, though you still have to zoom in by double tap or by using the zoom icons. The browser comes with support for flash light, though we found it only to work on small embedded flash files and not at all on larger sites like Hulu. We consider this a work in progress and hope that Flash 10.1 will make its way to the Devour before too long. Overall, the Motorola Devour is a nice Android-based smartphone. The large keyboard and Moto Blur user interface are ideal for people who like to stay connected via social networking and messaging, though I wish the display were larger and the camera took better images. Remember to visit PhoneArena.com for our full review of the Motorola Devour, including pictures and 360-degree rotational views.